Bad news for the thousands of people who use Baltimore's subway system each day. An emergency inspection finds that some of the tracks are in such bad shape, parts of the system will be shut down for weeks. WJZ investigator Mike Helgen is live at the Mondawmin station with a nightmare for riders. Mike? And Denise, the part that's shut down for weeks is that above ground area from West Cold Spring Lane to Owings Mills. The entire system will be shut down at least until Monday morning. Chopper 13 is over elevated portions of the Baltimore area's Metro subway link system that could be closed for weeks because of emergency track work, inconveniencing riders whose commutes have doubled or more as they wait for buses. As a parent, I mean, that, that's definitely a hardship for me. I mean, getting my kids to school, I mean, having public transportation is a necessity in a big city like Baltimore. The MTA administrator says they had no choice but to close the system to keep people safe. Safety is absolutely number one for us and number one for our passengers. What we know for sure is that the elevated section of the Metro subway from West Cold Spring up to Owings Mills Metro will be shut down for several weeks. It shouldn't be a surprise to anyone else at no. all. We've been discussing this for the past couple of years. Amalgamated transit union officials say they've been ringing alarm bells about unsafe conditions, but no one has been paying attention. Is the system safe right now? No, it is not. We can't come in now and say, oh, we aren't aware of it. This is sad. Last year, Metro riders watched in shock as a train became disconnected. Now the tracks are being fixed, something the union says should have happened long ago. I'm glad that it's happening without there being any fa fatalities, because there could have been fatalities with the trains rolling down the tracks uh, the way that they were up to this point. They've got extra buses running to get people where they need to go, but as one commuter just told me, it is very hectic, and it will be for some time to come. Back to you, Denise. All right, thank you, Mike. The metro system is 36 years old. Stay with WJZ for updates on the closure.